Bam Man Cavill, what can I say? Bam Man Cavill's a hustler. Uh, he's a wolf. Uh, he's an individual who makes money off of people who don't know no better. Um, which is pretty much life. You know, life is a Ponzi scheme. Life is a pyramid scheme. So um, I don't knock his hustle. But I will say this. Um, there is a thin line to the foolishness. Him not canceling Grant Cardone by saying you should feel ashamed if you don't make $400,000 a year, it's, it, it, you, you get into sellout territory. See, the thing about business is you have to get people to buy something. And nine times out of ten, the people who are buying something aren't willing to put in the work and effort to learn it themselves. Or they just want to skip some steps and they just want to pay for it to get it done. We all do that. That's why I said life, in a sense, is a Ponzi scheme to a, to a certain degree. Okay? Or a pyramid. Okay? Pyramid scheme is a little better. Okay? But this is the problem. When it comes to... um him saying that a lot of people pay just to have an addiction, that is true. A lot of people are willing to work to get $50 to $100 a day just to fuel their weed habit and their drinking habit. That is very, very true. But at the same time, Grant Cardone said, if you make $400,000 a year, you should feel ashamed. That's the part that is that, that that's, that's immature and distasteful. Um, if you make $400,000 a year, you are in pretty much the top 1% of earners in America. And you are definitely a one percenter in the world. Okay. If you make $400,000 a year, you make, it's basically 30 thousand a month. Okay. If you make that, you should feel very, very, very accomplished. And all you need is a couple of more flips to make a million dollars a year or just a million dollars, period. You could be a millionaire with $400,000 a year income. Let's say it take you five to 10 years, but it's going to happen. As long as you know how to invest properly, it's going to happen for you. So the fact that he didn't cancel this dude for saying you should feel ashamed, it just goes to show that there's a thin line uh from people that are trying to give you positive information and as people who are willing to give you information that's based on um, finessing. And he is a finesser and he is a known scammer. Yet, black people love to listen to him. He didn't, quote unquote, scam his own. He scammed the system, but he's a scammer and a liar through and through. The real estate game he gives you all will get you messed up. It's not thorough proof information. It's information that you give people who don't know any better. And he run up the money. And I can't blame him for that because those people should do their their own actual research and not listen to people who are willing to just tell them anything they want to hear. You know, he does a lot of questionable things. Um, like the BB the you know, male BBL thing and different things like that, you know, it, it, it's People look up to that. So, you know, that's just the world that we live in. So, uh, you know, what I do, I just focus on, you know, what I got going on. I don't really focus on or care what other people have going on. I'm just speaking on this particular video that I've seen is that if you're making $400,000 a year, you should not feel ashamed. Because if you feel ashamed for making $400,000 a year, what is somebody who's making $40,000 a year? Do they feel like they should kill themselves? If you make it four hundred thousand and you're ashamed, somebody make it forty, should they just off themselves? That's the question that you gotta ask yourself. Okay? I wanna hear from you guys in the chat and also in the comments what you think. Peace.